New for you this morning, the Boys and Girls Clubs of Ada County's goal is to provide a safe place for the kids in the Treasure Valley who need to be there. And with a new employee incentive, they hope to make it even safer. Chase Biefeld has that story. The Boys and Girls Club of Ada County are offering paid time off for all 107 of their employees to get COVID-19 vaccines. We've made the decision that we didn't want to mandate a vaccination. We didn't think that was right for a variety of reasons. Um, so what we decided to do was provide some incentives for staff who might be you know, on the fence about getting a vaccination. Boys and Girls Club Executive Director Colleen Braga says employees will get paid time off for their first and second second dose appointments, including a little something extra. Those that can document that they've received both the first and second vaccination are eligible to take a, an additional paid day off. This incentive comes after the Idaho's COVID-19 Vaccine Advisory Committee updated the second priority group, essential workers, to include school staff, teachers, and child care workers. Over 95% of the staff have already received their first dose or have made an appointment to do so. You know, some of them are young. They they, I'm not saying they don't take it quite as seriously, but I don't think that they are quite as worried as, as some of us who are not quite as young. So uh, the, the thought of getting a paid day off for, for doing really the right thing is, um, you know, uh, kind, of, kind of attractive to them. Before the pandemic, the Boys and Girls Club of Ada County served almost 7,000 kids a day at their seven clubs across the valley. Now, they only see about 3,800 kids a day, even though they've opened two additional sites to serve the community. Braga hopes this incentive will bring attendance back up and bring the club one step closer to normalcy. If families know that our staff have been vaccinated and that the club is a safe place for congregate settings, then they'll, they'll be more comfortable sending their kids here. And really, kids need us now more than ever. So we, we want to be able to serve as many as uh, are out there that need us. Chase Beefelt, Idaho's News Channel 7. Now, Braga is now encouraging other employers to try this paid time off incentive instead of a vaccine mandate. She says it encourages staff to do the right thing, but still gives them a choice in the matter when it comes to their own bodies. It's clearly worked for her since over 95% of her staff, Doug, are participating in this incentive. 95%.